Pakistan's integration of the Chinese Origin PL-17 ultra-long-range air-to-air missile onto its J-10C vigorous Dragon fighter fleet represents one of the most consequential developments in modern aerial warfare, redefining the balance of power across South Asia. The decision to operationalize this system marks a deliberate attempt to bypass traditional force asymmetries by leveraging technological breakthroughs that allow a numerically smaller air force to hold at risk the very assets that enable adversarial superiority. The PL-17 missile, engineered for engagements at ranges beyond 400 kilometers, when paired with a networked four and a half generation platform, such as the J-10C, creates a new paradigm of air dominance centered not on dogfighting or short-range missile combat, but on strategic interdiction of high-value airborne targets far behind contested airspace. The physical integration of this missile was itself a complex undertaking. The J-10C airframe required significant reinforcement to accommodate the missile's extraordinary dimensions and mass. With a 7-meter length and an estimated weight, of 2,500 kilograms, demanding structural hardpoints that surpass the tolerances of earlier pylons. Pakistan's engineers, in collaboration with Chinese counterparts, introduced reinforced titanium aluminum alloy centerline pylons capable of bearing the immense load while preserving aerodynamic stability. These pylons were not simple mechanical mounts, but complex electromechanical nodes featuring advanced data buses for high bandwidth communication and robust power delivery systems that replace the legacy pneumatic and hydraulic release mechanisms used for smaller air-to-air -air weapons.